What's going on, Gemini gang? I'm back for you. Welcome back to the Jewelry Box with your girl, Jess. Here to drop these jewels. This is your end of the year reading, okay? Um, It can travel in a good, you know, 30 days. Because I know everybody's like, bitch, the year is over. Uh, no, not really. Okay, we got a week. <laughs> but, um, yeah, everybody going to have ears before we get to 2024. Know that, okay? But, Gemini, you are up. We're going to get in. At first, I kept hearing, let's get it. How about the G this a G5? No, this not a big one. Whatever. But that song, so I was hearing that, but then um, I started, and I seen some numbers. So you could be seeing fives, fours, ones, or seven, or you could be seeing like 54, 17, or 17, 54, something like that. Or look up that year, 17, 54, see what happened, okay? Um, some of you guys, you have a business idea, or you may have a business or something, or you have some sort of idea. You need to get on it and like really work on that and push that out there um and give that some more focus because um some of you guys i feel like your your place of employment is like is not healthy for you right um and it could just you know cause a lot of mental stress a lot of anxiety whatever but the thing about stress stress is the number one leading cause to everything else okay so you stress out your body break down all that whatever whatever so could definitely be like your job or whatever uh weight loss you know breaking out highs whatever um just heavy anxiety and i don't know heart palpitations for someone here but um it's definitely probably your job okay like you also have energy around you that is literally trying to stop and block everything you have going on. This isn't a job. This literally could just be the environment you're in and the people you're around, okay, that are very toxic and low vibrational. Like, these people literally are trying to put an end to you, okay? I'm looking at the death card in reverse. They ain't stopping shit. Oh, and then the stop card and Panther. Like, these people really are trying to stop you here. Um, But you, my dear, at this time are a great manifester, like your wish is your command so just you know start manifesting and putting in that work okay like they can't you're unstoppable right now like legit that's how i feel and i feel like these people are there's people around you who want you to stop leveling up so that way they can feel better about themselves okay <clears throat> yeah so you definitely got people feeling like pennies with holes in it okay hopeless and everything else but these folks definitely want to try to stop you so let's get into it for you gemini and see what we have yeah these people want to come back around and negotiate because they want to be in your energy but you already know about these people i feel like these are people also like not only just from your past but like a past life like they come around every lifetime and they always like manage to destroy or you know screw you over while you're in your life's journey and you don't like finish out everything that you need to finish out because these people come in and like cause all these blocks and delays but they can't do that this lifetime okay they're coming back around trying to negotiate trying to get back in your life but you already know about these people so you're just not like you're not giving you're not doing okay when i tell y'all the like i'm a gemini son so when i tell y'all the amount of blockages and delays and shit that's going on in my life is real but for me like you know the message that i'm gonna give y'all today is like like i get why it's happening i essentially know who is throwing this energy in the air like i know who's evil eyeing me yes i'm doing my protection to everything else under the sun but you know there's still residue some things you know that hit whatever but it's like i don't know what see the good thing about me is i don't record like on camera i just show cards right but if i would show you how swollen like my lip is i don't know where like a reaction out of something i, I don't know it's weird but it's like there's a lot of like things that are like that literally just started happening so i don't know if somebody is even fucking around with like this full moon energy or whatever and trying to just like really fuck with your your christmas gemini but yeah like there's a lot of that bs that is really taking place right now so just you know do your protection stay prayed up you know because the people the year is closing out and they're like they do feel like they're running out of time like i don't know what they're trying to do if they're trying to like make your 2024 crumble if they're trying to make you crumble period but just keep your protection up keep your prayers high okay keep your vibe high and divine holy spirit let's see what do we have here for gemini 
Yeah, we have selling. Somebody doesn't want you to sell. Okay, like I said, if you're an entrepreneur, somebody does not want you to have sales. Somebody does not want you to be successful. Somebody does not want you to have clients. They don't want people to um, do business with you. But you're still handling business as you as you should. Okay, um, you could be a parent. All right, or well, you're even very apparent. Like you, there is a, a lot of transparency in you. Like people see exactly what you're doing. Like you're not lying. You're not hiding about what it is that you're doing. People ask you like you're not that type of person. Like if you have something and people want to know where you bought it or where you got it, you don't like gatekeep. Like you 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 tell right. So you're very open. And people ask you a question like how you get something or how you got to a certain point in your life. You tell them with no problem. I see a lot of you people um here Gemini's that um despite whatever life has thrown at you you continue to flourish you continue to still handle business and do what you need to do some of you guys um could need to up your vitamin c intake okay um get you some emergencies all right <laughs> but um your immune system you know somebody wants you to be sick or whatever but we have changes here um the butterfly okay you, it, your wings are spreading it's time for you to fly my love Okay, you've been chilling in the cocoon probably even since your birthday, since the summer, and now the winter is here. It's time for you to flourish, okay? Big changes are happening. I feel like even your heart, like, and it's crazy because I said heart palpitations, and here we have unexpected expenses, and we have a stethoscope, okay? So somebody could end up with some sort of medical bill and then go to the doctor or the hospital or something like that, okay? You could work in a health field, all right? You could be a banker even, but um, somebody could work at a coffee shop, okay? Or you love coffee, or maybe you need a good cup of coffee with this green. Maybe you treat yourself to a Starbucks, baby. If that ain't your thing, if you a Dunkin' person like me, treat yourself to a Starbucks, baby. Okay? But, um, yeah, that's that, okay? Because I'm trying not to even be all crazy long. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, you're just, you're having a good time right now. Like, you're enjoying life for what it is, right? And you have people around you who are really upset because they don't understand why you're still smiling. And again, these are people of a past life. Okay? Like, what is this trying to pop up? Yeah, these people are trying to curse you so that you can abandon your journey. So that other people will abandon you. So that you're lonely. You're alone. You don't have no help. But you're healing. And some of you guys, you could just be a healer. Okay? These are real shallow ass people. Shallow how? They're mad that you put up boundaries and they feel like you're you're wrong for putting up boundaries. This could be family, okay? Somebody that you have a family with. Somebody that you're trying to build a foundation with, okay? Some of you guys, I just saw a big cat, Leo Energy, could want to come and build a foundation with you. When you see it, uh, 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 and sparks will fly. When the sparks will fly. And the sparks will fly. Who is that? It's, I think it's Janae Aiko. And I want to say B.O.B. -B. I want to feel like it's him. So my name could be Bob. But let's see what we got here. From the Hidden Heart Secrets. Okay. You could be meeting. Like somebody who got big dick energy. And like the sparks are going to fly instantaneously. Yeah, you got some bitter ass people around you, and that stay behind. What? Uh, yeah, these hopeless people, they're bitter. Because that stay behind. Like they want to keep you behind. You have bitter people who want you to stay behind. Like no child left behind ass face. Get out of here. Like somebody wants you to drag them along because they can't do it for themselves. They want to be pushed into like your luxury. Somebody want to be down. Um, crew love. They be loving the crew, Gemini. As much shit as they talk about you, they love the fuck out you. What I said about this chemistry here. You got chemistry. The sparks will fly, like I said. Somebody is digging you. And like, then I just say, and people wanted to isolate you, didn't want you to have nobody. They've been trying to curse you so that you feel abandoned, be abandoned. But you got somebody who got their eye on you. And it's crazy how this chemistry under him, and he's just, like, staring, and it's like, damn, look at her. You know, she handling business. She running her household, like, businesswoman, great mom, da da da, da. He's just sitting there thinking and pondering about being with her. Yeah, chemistry. Somebody digging you. Digging to see, digging on you. Ooh, baby, baby, ooh, baby, baby. But they could be wearing a mask. Chris Brown. 
Yeah, clarity. Whoever this was been trying to hold back and like not say anything, but they can't they can't wear this mask anymore. Like Halloween's over. They can't <laughs> but they it's like they see the truth. Like they know that you are very impressionable. You're very likable. Other people definitely want you. And they can't hide it anymore. Somebody can't hide their feelings for you. Something could have happened in July. With these fireworks out. Something could have even happened in September. Where I'm from, they crack them shits from like Mother's Day. From like Cinco de Mayo all the way up until... <laughs> to like Labor Day. So, May, June, July, August, September. The summer months, pretty much. <laughs> could be very significant here with this energy you could have met this person or something like that or whatever but it's like this person they can't hide these feelings anymore like they can't deny this attraction that they have to you you guys could definitely be at a distance here or there's some sort of separation or blockage and maybe i was talking about that there's a lot of separation like a lot of delays a lot of blockages taking place right now yeah underneath we have distracted okay with the delays here and then we have time though this is like divine timings at play or you've just been waiting or there's like this constant cycle that needs to be closed out because somebody is with the shits. But um, you definitely got somebody who, I mean, y'all could live like across town from each other or like a state over from one another. But it's like this person can't deny how they feel about you anymore. OK. Um, and aside from that, like your passion really like. Somebody thinks that what you what you're doing is fake or like you're like how you live is fake. <laughs> so I, I don't I just heard earhead. Like somebody feels like when I see the MTV guy like back in the day, I'm dating myself, okay, whatever. But like it was showing him and he would like be floating out into space or whatever to place like the MTV flag, or whatever. But um <laughs> like somebody just feels like you're in like a delusional land, like nothing like somebody keeps trying to go around and say that what you're doing is fake or what you're what you're speaking on you're not gonna accomplish or it's not real. And the reason why they're trying to say that is because like they're doing spell work on you. Somebody is really trying to block and stop you. They're doing spell work. This is somebody who may, they don't live on the same street on you as you or in the same city. Like they might live in the same state, but like somebody is trying to get other people to believe that you aren't who you are. They keep going around and making up all these lies and saying, oh, they're exaggerating. They're faking. That's not who Gemini really is. And it's like, yo, you're a fucking hater. Why don't you worry about who the fuck you are and get off Gemini dick? Like, I mean it that way. We have only you. Like, you're devoted. You're true. You're real. Somebody knows that. Like, people who really fuck with you know that about you, Gemini. And somebody just does not like the fact that it's only you, Gemini, who can who can make some shit shake. Only you can come out of a cocoon and become a butterfly in the winter. Like, in real life, how many butterflies? Like, if you're somewhere where it's cold, like I am. Like, I'm up in um, New England. How many butterflies do you see in the wintertime? Like, let's be real. Like, you are a rose that grew out of concrete, Gemini. Like, dead ass. And people are mad because people, like, lusting after you. And this could be in a good or a bad way. Like, yeah, it could be sexual. People want you sexually. Like, they find you highly attractive, right? You got that youthful soul, that young energy. We like Benjamin Button, baby. We age backwards as we get older. But you also got these people who aren't committed to, like, themselves. But they want to be committed to your life and destroying you. But they have no, like, they have no self-control. They have no motivation, no, like, no motivation and passion within themselves. So they want to stop you, okay? This is a lot of forbidden energy. Somebody's doing some forbidden work. Forbidden dark work. Somebody's doing some shit they really ain't got no business doing. Like, they don't. And they don't know what the fuck they doing. They don't. Somebody went off and ventured through the library, found the book, did some dumbass shit. I heard they gonna have to pay. Y'all look at this nightmares as I cut the deck. They gonna have to pay. But not for nothing, I heard they family gonna have to pay. Somebody was really trying to wish some real nasty shit on you, Gemini. Look at this. Friendships. I don't make this shit up. The people who are close to them, people that they call family, could be real family. Shit. For some of you Geminis, these are people that you thought were your friends, people or like people that you thought you know freak with you, and they don't. They phony as fuck. They wear that mask.
Yeah, I feel like things kind of could have slowed down for you a little bit in the summer, in the middle of the year. And that's when, you know, you kind of did go into, like, your cocoon element so that you can gear up and get your shit right. Like, you started off the year hot with a bang, then you just slowed down, right? And that's when they was trying to say all this shit because you, you slowed down, you weren't on the scene like that. But you was minding your business and getting your life together, and now you back, you know, you, I, you your your wings have spread you know like you're the beautiful butterfly because you went into your cocoon and everybody trying to say like what the fuck yeah look these nosy motherfuckers trying to find shit on you or whatever whatever think that they know everything about you 55 yes yeah, a big ass tower for they ass everything that yeah and it's funny i just got a text of a whole bunch of laughing faces like it's funny as fuck like these people was clowns like they thought they had shit on you and they didn't have shit on you they thought they knew you they didn't know you what's chemistry Yeah, look at this. There's somebody who sits around and thinks about you, okay? And it's crazy. I was just talking about, like, an allergic reaction. She, and it's like she in the hospital, she said. <laughs> but, yes, they definitely wanted, like, whatever it was that you were doing, they wanted you to not fuck with it anymore. But it's like something could have slowed down, but it gave you time to really think and revamp and rebrand and, like, get everything back together. Like, you just been reserving your energy 3149. Like, you just... You're not, you don't give into the bullshit, Gemini, okay? Not like, you got elderlies or your ancestors who's helping you save, like, behind your back. They're helping you. Like, you have mad help. Some of you, I feel like you're choosing to be alone, like you're saving yourself for somebody who's worth your time. Not like saving for marriage necessarily, but just saving yourself for somebody who's worth your time. Like, you're just not out here sharing off your sexual energy, especially after we saw that lesson card. Like, you're not just giving your energy to any and everybody. Like, you're chilling, feel me? And you're stacking your bread, okay? Yeah, 19 here, sun card. You're working, like, low-key, high-key on your own victory. Like, there's something that has sparked your interest that you know is going to be very lucrative. But you're keeping it under hush, as you should, because you got people who really just... They trying to destroy everything that you fucking have. And like I said, there's there's family here, okay, who could be doing this. This is 46. Come on. Can we, um, yeah, 46. Okay, that breaks down to a 10. The first card that actually fell out, though, was natural disaster. Okay, 38. Could be somebody ages here. But somebody really wanted to, like, destroy what you had. Like I said, you could be a parent, right? Somebody wanted to make your family life hard. Somebody was trying to put some shit on you and your family, okay? You could have had some incidences of like your family members or like your close your close family, um friends. I'm trying to get the word relatives out. Mercury retrograde. It's not eating me up that bad, but it, it be doing what it do when it need to. <laughs> but um like somebody was really trying to attack like you and your family and shit, trying to delay you, trying to slow you down. Um, shit, it could even be some of your own family members or people that you call family. Hell, even your work family, like they was doing this and trying to act like they weren't doing it, trying to wear a mask, but they were. But somebody, like I said, and then I say that, oh, they gonna get it. And it was like even their family, cause somebody was sending shit and trying to like attack your whole bloodline. Okay, and now their whole bloodline about to be wiped, smooth the fuck out. Yeah, somebody was definitely trying to with this withdrawal energy here, this is 60, somebody could have been trying to, like, take out your parents or some shit like that, some weird shit, okay, because they, they wanted to take out your support system, somebody did not want you to have any sort of support, and now that shit about to happen to them, somebody wanted you to be rejected by your family, somebody wanted you to be isolated and alone, but little do they know that even with doing this to you, like, this helped you focus on your bag, helped you focus on getting your shit together, and now the crazy shit is, Gemini, you could be sitting on top of the world and everybody's coming to you because you took this time alone to get your shit together. Now, like I said, everybody's asking you how you do it. And you're not a gatekeeper. You're going to let them know. But the crazy shit is, like, do people really want to sit in this isolation and shit that you was, like, kind of forced into unbeknownst to you, but you just took it and, you know, ran with it and did what you had to do? They don't like you, Gemini, because you know how to transmute the negative energy. That's that double people in you. Yeah, and this distance, the first card that came out in reverse is gain, 25, 7. Somebody ain't learned a fucking lesson. Somebody was definitely trying to stop you from gaining 9 of Pentacles type energy. That's 10 of Cups. So we got some Pisces. We got some Virgo out here. Those opposite signs, okay? Somebody is like oil and water, ebony and ivory. Somebody is nothing like you. They're the complete opposite of you. But some strange reason, they want to feel like you're copying them or you're stealing some sort of shine from you, but you're on like two different lanes. And this person doesn't know how to stay in their lane. 
This is a lesson they haven't learned to stay in their fucking lane and mind their business. What is this? Yeah, because they wanted to stop you from gaining 14 Sagittarius energy. That's temperance and the tarot. Somebody really wanted to disturb your peace. They didn't want you to have anything. They want you to become codependent. They want you to be in balance. But nonetheless, like, you still stay grounded regardless. It's like, yeah, the thing is, your faith in God is so strong. You know that something may be delayed. It may seem like a block, but it's really delayed. It's not denied. And if something is blocked, then it's not for you. God gives you something better, and you know that. Shit, I know that. Just because somebody blocks something don't mean that something in that same category is not going to come along. It's like, you know, maybe I was looking at getting a Honda Civic. And it's like, oh, you can't get the Honda Civic. But here's the keys to the Porsche. Look here. Okay? It's that type of energy. God said, nah, you're not a Honda Civic baby no more. I'm going to upgrade you. Here's a Lexus. You know, it's that type of energy. So somebody keeps trying to block you only for you to be given bigger and better blessings. Somebody really didn't want you to... Yeah, baby, come on with it. Yes, spirit, tell them. 75, now this person is tripping, okay? And they're having nightmares because everything that they tried to stop and block from you, you have been given better, okay? Like I said, things could have slowed down in the summer. You know, all the way up to what I said, September with the fireworks thing. All the way up until September, something was definitely slowed down. Everything that you was trying to work on or do was getting delayed, blocked, whatever, rejected. And all of a sudden, things started gently picking back up. And what you were denied for or blocked from, you're now getting better. Okay, like even if work was shitty, work is way fucking better now. Like you could have went through some shit at work and you went through it. You went through it with your work family. You feel me? You, you reserved your energy. The bullshit happened. Somebody thought they was going to get you fired or have you, you know, lose your job or not have, you know, whatever. And you just remain calm through it. And now somebody's worst nightmare because... You still at the job. You still got your shit going on. Yeah, people fighting over you. Conflict. Five of Wands energy. Leo energy. And I said that in the beginning. I mentioned the Leo. Now somebody fighting over you. People fighting. 30. 30 for 30. Ain't that on Sports Center? Yeah, they looking at you. They like recording your life or watching you or some shit. Like you a documentary. Yeah, and they heavily committed to this shit. 34. Somebody's heavily committed to trying to take you out or some shit. Somebody cannot stand you. When I tell you somebody cannot stand you, bro, like, they trying to bribe people and everything to come up against you, to stop you. 52. Again, that's the reverse of 25 because they don't want to see you gain. They're trying to get more people in on stopping you and blocking you because it's like, why you? Why Gemini? Why is Gemini accomplishing? Why Gemini? Why, 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 why? Block Gemini. Stop Gemini. Like, nigga, sit down. And I meant to how I said it. I know how YouTube like to filter. Do that. You ain't stunting nobody. You busy working on your money and getting away from all this drama and this bullshit. You ain't trying to play yourself. If you're a masculine energy, somebody definitely trying to um lie to you and shit because they don't want you to walk away because they need your money. Okay? This person can have Sagittarius placements. They broke. And they don't want to see you go because, yeah, the devil. They're trying to have this sort of bond with you or stay attached to you. Somebody could be losing a car. Or they car about to stop working. Somebody could be losing their home with the chariot and the four wands in reverse. Yeah. Gemini, you ain't worried about that shit. You just manifesting. You ain't got no love. No love. <laughs> no love. No love. No love. Because the high priestess, you already know what's up. You know that this person was juggling or trying to make you juggle or was trying to come up against you. Was working with multiple people against you. They were part of that crew too. So you don't give a fuck. All that shit that they was talking, they can eat that. All that shit they was trying to hand to you. They can hold that. <laughs> oh, sorry. Yeah, you even, like... I feel like somebody also was trying to say, like, something was wrong with you. Like, you was off the Richter scale or whatever, or, like, delusional or some bullshit. Nah, you pretty solid. You even. You mellow all the way across the board. Somebody definitely wanted to have you in an emotional up-down roller coaster type of shit. Somebody wanted you to be in this conflict and this, like, this anger, this haste or whatever. So that way you couldn't focus on you. Like, you focus on you and they focus on you. Somebody focus on the wrong motherfucking thing. Okay? We gonna say that. Because that's what's going on. Boom, lovers, DR Gemini in reverse. You're not fucking with people and people trying to keep you out your element. And not for nothing, I feel like some of you, you you may feel like you're out of element right now, but again, God's rejection is your protection. That's what I'm getting. You're going through a change right now. 
you are not who people want to believe that you are or what they think they know of you. You are not that person no more. You are no longer that energy. Okay? Yeah, because the back and forth. You got that sash energy right there with this Knight of Wands. But you got some you got people who keep trying to come in and out your life. That's the problem. It's like Gemini, some of you Geminis, or just Gemini, I'm just saying it, because I don't feel like, you know, doing all that. Take what's for you, leave the rest behind. It's a general message, baby, okay? Um, there's some people in your life you still got to cut off. There's some people you still allow to come up in your life, come up in your energy. You keep trying to get people the benefit of the doubt. Stop. No, nope, because you know. You know these motherfuckers don't want to see you shine. So just cut them off. And I, and I know that And what people don't understand with Gemini is like, It'd be hard for us to like really cut people off because we are we do genuinely care about people. Like we love people and we genuinely want to see everybody doing better. But the crazy shit is like people want to give Gemini such a terrible and a bad reputation. It's not that. Like I mean, there are some extremely low. I know some low vibrational Gemini. Trust me, I do. But when you got you a Gemini who want to up and up, who vibe behind. Now nah, we love people. We always helpful. We want to be like where we are the youthful ones. We're the children. We're very friendly. We're the friendly signs. We represent the house of, of fucking friends and family and shit. We're third house energy. That's what we represent. Like we, we like we take care. We do take care of people. We have that nurture inside, that love inside. We we are very helpful and all of that. But there are some people that you cannot no longer help or you need to like get away from because these people who keep trying to come in and out your life, they're trying to destroy you, bro, sis. Okay. And yes, Gemini, that indecisiveness, you need to cut that out. Stay on one side. I mean it. Yeah, no going back to the past. Leave the past in the past. Scorpio energy. You know you're not dealing with the past no more. You know the past is no good. Okay. Whoever it is, somebody you could have kids with or whatever, or childhood friends, family that, you know, done fucked you over enough. You know not to fuck with these people no more. Yeah, and then we got 666, balance. 666 all in a row, balance. Underneath it all, is, it's a victory. So maybe you could be losing, like, connections with, like, people that you once considered friends. Okay, maybe you are having a falling out with the other parent. Maybe, you know, you're having a falling out with certain family members or whatever. But the reason why this is happening is because these people are causing your life to go into some sort of stagnation. They're trying to stop you. Underneath it all, there's a victory that's trying to come through. So you might feel a little off because the energy around you is definitely trying to, like, bind you. Somebody's trying to bind you. Like, I'm seeing, like, a dark a dark room. I don't know, like, a tomb, I guess, in, like, the ball and chain. It's giving me, like, saw vibes. Somebody's, like, fucking with you and trying to fuck around in your energy. But underneath all of this, there's still a victory that prevails, Leo energy. Like, there's still a win. Like, I don't know. Yeah, see? Ten of Cups, family. In the past, you could have cut off some family. You could have been dealing with family. You found your happiness and your peace. And somebody didn't like that. So, like I said, you got people who coming back around that you know really don't fuck with you. Because they trying to take away from your cups. Them six cups coming from that ten leave four cups. They trying to leave you feeling rejected. And like you lost and missed out. Like that's what these people doing. And you know that shit though, Gemini. So don't fuck with them. Yeah, exactly. We got four, six, 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 six. We got four sixes on the board already moving forward like you don't you're not fucking with these people you're not giving any energy you're not doing anything because you know that these people they take you out of your element they're delaying you because i feel like you 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 done hit the ground running you was going full speed ahead but now you got people around you who keep trying to cause all these conflicts and these issues in your life or whatever to slow you down and keep you off your focus like to throw you off yeah like i said somebody mm, king of cups in reverse Right now, you could be emotionally upset. Some of you could be drinking more than usual, okay? You could be dealing with some sort of mental health issues, a lot of anxiety, okay? But that's because of the people that surround you. And the crazy shit is, like, Gemini, you notice. You're wondering why you're off. Like, the main energy is that you're not in your complete element right now. And the, and the reason being why is because you have people around you who are literally trying to play on your heartstrings and act like they care about you, and they don't. They don't. They're just committed to fucking with you and fucking you over. It's because you're nice. Stop being nice to people, Gemini. Like, stop being nice. Yeah, the universe is saying, get out your head. Stop being nice. That's your energy, Gemini. Stop worrying about everybody. Stop worrying. You need to focus on you right now. Now you need to put a lot of focus on yourself. 
Have a spa day. Sit up and watch movies. Binge watch a series. Chill by yourself. Alone. Like, I feel like during this alone time, you're going to think of a brilliant idea. You're going to develop something that you're going to be able to sell. And you are going to be busy with a lot of clientele. Okay? There's something that you have, but you have to sit by yourself so that you can, like, really receive the full download. I feel like you're trying to get the download, but you can't because every there's people who are around you who knows that you're supposed to be getting these sort of messages or something's supposed to be taking place. And these people keep trying to act like, oh, I need, like, being they're being damsels in distress to slow you down and stop you. Yeah. Block these motherfuckers. You hoping that, you're wondering if you can. Yes, the fuck you can. You wondering or you're wondering if you're being blocked or if you're going to be blocked, that, that Leo energy. Okay, like especially with your finances, because that's like that Leo Virgo cusp. You're wondering like if like you're you're going to be blocked. And it's like, no, what is this? My signature look. No, because Gemini, you are Gemini. Nobody can't do Gemini better than like regardless of whatever. And it's it's like duh, but it's like nah, because it's like Gemini is too people bro and it's like you don't know who that other part of gemini can be like not like you know like replicating like we're a twin whether or not we might be identical we might be fraternal twins and our other twin could be like a sag or it could be like a libra or it could be like a pisces you get what i'm saying like like you could really like your gemini could be like gemini sun and then whatever your rising is or whatever your moon is feel me so you could really embody like two zodiacs really strong as a gemini you're just one like mm, okay whatever yeah look we got the queen of swords in reverse gemini that is libra energy but i just feel like you wonder if you're gonna be able to block people yes the fuck you are and you're gonna do it and it's crazy did i say libra i might have but you you're gonna do it in a very cold way and i don't know why i just like some of you are gonna feel bad about it some of you aren't, but some of you are going to feel bad because, like I said, this is not, it's not the type of energy that you usually like to give out. But some, some people deserve it, Gemini. They deserve your ass to kiss. They do. Yeah, and this is what I'm letting you know. With this moon card coming out, cancer energy, that nurturing energy, right? Fuck that shit. It's time for you to let loose, tell people about themselves, don't hold back, don't be um passive aggressive. It's, you need to be very fucking aggressive, yeah, because somebody trying to fuck with your coins and your stability, okay? Somebody wants to, st like I said, like everything that you're working on. So you, it's time for you to cut people off. Didn't I mention that four cups? You Yeah, they want you like this, rejecting shit, just sitting there pondering, no, we're not... We're not rejecting or missing shit. They can go kick rocks somewhere. Yeah, because like I said, somebody trying to play in your face. Come in and out, okay? And ain't nobody ain't nobody got time for that. It, they don't, okay? Ain't nobody got time for that. Simple as that. Simple as that. So let's close this out, Gemini. It's been fun. It's okay for me to cry when I need to. And some, some of y'all, maybe y'all need to do that. Because, like, you just can't believe that, you know, how certain people can be or treat you or act, you know. And it's like, you ain't do shit to nobody or shit to this person. And they, I don't know, you just got some real bitter, um, bad-minded, waste-body type of energy around you. My destiny will reveal itself in time. Yeah, radiate confidence. Some, and they don't like that about you, Gemini, that you don't give a fuck. And since they don't like that you give off the energy of you don't give a fuck, even though you may not say that or treat them that way, it's your energy, it's your essence. Since they feel that way about you, show their ass and say that and don't give a fuck about them and let them know to their face since they already feel that way about you. Confirm it. And maybe you didn't feel that way, but give them a confirmation that they need and send them on their way because these people, they're they not fucking with you. They're not for you. Yeah, surrender to the spirit energy, okay? And keep your heart open. Yeah, meditate on the answer, Gemini, okay? And the name is that green again, your heart chakra, okay? Just keep moving from a space of love. I feel like somebody wants you to be cold. Like, they don't want you to be loving. And you only got that one that came out, and I'm going to do it just like that. Strong, brave, and bold. That's who you are, and the snakes around you do not like it. They don't like your confidence. Somebody trying to attack your sacral chakra and your heart chakra. They don't want you to be passionate, that chemistry card, that passion. They don't want you to have this passion. 
Keep your heart open. The change is here. The change is now, Gemini. That has been your message. I really hope it helps. You know I love your face, okay? Gemini gang gang out. That's what we got. Have a wonderful, happy holiday, okay? Felice Christmas Kwanzaa Club, whatever it is that you do. You get what I'm saying? If it's none of them, then it is what it, what it is. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.